Hello everyone, so today we're going to talk about gun protection. Okay, what's happening if somebody can grab your firearm? So we start actually from the difficult part, from the back, and then we're going from the front. Okay, so some things we must accept, because if you're not going to accept, then basically you got to uh, play self-defense, or you got to train in illusion, and I don't want that. So first of all, when somebody takes the gun, you want to grab it fast as possible. This is first of all. Second, maybe this hand's already coming for a choke. Okay? So you need to understand somebody maybe will hold you and choke you and pull the gun out. Okay? Or maybe somebody only just will come, okay, and try to grab it. Okay? And this is what you need to do the following. When somebody come and grab, okay, not to concentrate in here. Okay, because you see his arms, underarms free, for him to pull the gun, okay, it's much easier, okay? What you want to do when he puts the arms, you want to go full. If he pull out, pull harder now, harder, 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 oh, it's more difficult, okay? More difficult, so I secure my gun for longer, okay? So I try to go full, okay? Then, if the gun is out, I got to let him to take out, take out a little bit. Then I'm going here to secure the firearms, okay? Basically almost like a figure four on his arms. And of course I will try to turn fast as possible to have a target to fight with and disarm it. Or maybe he will hold and go to put the choke, okay? I cannot afford to deal with the choke. If it's condition three, definitely. Definitely I can go to deal with the shock. Meaning, okay, even if he pull the firearms, pull, okay, this gun is not loaded. Okay, he will try to shoot me, but he's not respond. So it means for me, I can have control, bam, fight, release, uh, uh, fight from there, bam, 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 bam. Okay, and the magazine comes in, walk in, okay, look where's the magazine, it's the magazine. So if I'm out from and then put, and respond, okay? This is if you can condition three. This is the plus, okay, of can condition three. If you condition one, then I cannot afford to go here because if I'm turning and he takes the gun, and it's one, basically press the trigger and game over. So of course, things become more difficult because I need to here. Now he maybe choke me, yeah, and I'm losing losing air, okay, or take me to the ground. So I'm on fast to take the arms up as possible to make sure they have the gun to stay down, to control from there. So, again, if you're not choking, wrong, right, and I put my body weight back a little bit. He will try to pull the gun, Secure. If the gun not out, I take the arms up because I want the gun. I want the gun fast as possible. If you choke, condition one, count. Okay, condition one, one. Yeah, he pulling, he struggling. Oh, catch, choke harder. And that's it. You have the gun. Condition one. Do whatever you need to. If it's condition three, yeah, then definitely I can heal from here. Take, take the gun, take the gun. Yeah, and fight for me. Hush, shut up. Okay, then I can take my uh, my uh, approach in different way. So this is a gun defense from the back. God bless, color system.